Hi, I'm Amy with crazybeautiful.com and I'm going to show you today how to make a stair step card. So let's get started. You'll take your five and a half by eight and a half inch cardstock and get it out on your paper. You're simply scored. We're going to score from three inches, but we only want to go down to about seven and a half. So we want to hold it up about an inch from the bottom of the paper. So take an extra piece of cardstock or an envelope, just something that has, you know, a 90 degree angle and set it at your seven and a half inch mark while you do your scoring. So make sure that's in the corner. So come back here to three inches and score down to where your guide is. There you go. And then we're going to turn it. Actually, want the three inch section up here at the top of my scoreboard. And we're going to score it at one, two, three and a half, four and three quarters, and six and a half. And then we're going to rotate it to the side that doesn't have anything scored on it yet and score it at four and a quarter. So that's going to be the main fold for our card. Now you're going to switch from this point to your paper trimmer. And you can either use the, I would suggest using, like if yours has a ruler on it, here or here. Um, you're going to take that three inch section, has this, all the multiple score lines, line it up right here at three inches and we're going to follow that score guide through the middle to trim it. And we're going to trim it from this point here down to here. So this is um, two and a half. No, this is two inches. Let me look at my ruler. So this is about two inches down to about seven and a half. So I'm just going to kind of approximate because mine is the rotary trimmer and just trim out that middle section that you cut or that you scored from. So there you go. Um, I'm going to just bend my four and a quarter inch first because that's the easy uh, one that's kind of all alone. And then actually I did it backwards. There you go. So you want the one with the multiple, like all the multiple score lines on the right side. And that front one will come down and become a mountain. So if you didn't quite cut all the way to the edge there, you can just come back with the little paper snips, cut in there, and then just fold them back and forth until you get to your finished card. So this will be a great card base then for a stair step card. Um, the sample that I have, I actually screwed up a couple times, but you can see how I just have my little balloons here on a piece of clear window sheet and that really gives kind of a fun effect for all three layers um, that all three steps and um, that's all I have for today so um, thanks for watching my video have a great day